Today we're going to be talking about my Survivor Series cane. This figure is from the Elite Collection, and the paint job is accurate and well done. The figure comes with two accessories, one being a steel chair, and the other one being a additional set of interchangeable hands. Also with it being from the Elite Collection, the posability is the best of its kind. When speaking about the artwork, there's not a lot going on whatsoever in the background. Other than basic labeling, there's not a whole lot going on in the foreground neither. And speaking of artwork, let's take a look at the sides of the box. So compared to the front of the box, they really utilized the extra space. And speaking of space, if you choose to display these like this, it's nice for organizing. Now let's take a look at the back of the box. So just by first glance, I can already tell you that I'm a fan of the back of this box. In addition to the other figures in this series, it also has some stats. From parts unknown, weight 323 pounds, height 7 foot tall. Career highlights, WWE Champion, Intercontinental Champion, WWE Tag Team Champion. The Big Red Machine joined Team WWE in a winner-takes-all match against Team Alliance at Survivor Series 2001. First off, I don't care what you say, that was a great match and I enjoyed every second of it. Second off, I really enjoy the fact that there's a bit of lore about this figure and the event that it was based on. So, that wraps up this video. Be sure to let me know your thoughts and concerns about this video in the comments down below. And if you're new here, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you're always notified on the latest content. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like and share this video with anyone you know that might find it interesting and or helpful.